I think there's been a lot of hope in our little community that Apple may launch their AR VR headset this year. We'd heard earlier in the year a lot of speculation that that actually might happen. Some people even thought that Apple could have made an made an announcement of that product at Worldwide Developer Conference. Obviously, that didn't work out. And more recently, we've been hearing that the whole project has sort of been delayed for a number of reason, reasons, including supply chain and just how markets are going and, and some technical issues that Apple has run into that we've discussed on this show. This week, according to analyst Ming-Chi Kuo, Kuo thinks that uh, as Meta pulls back a little bit on its VR hardware to focus on their primary business, Apple could be primed to make a big impact with their AR VR headset, and he thinks that release could debut in January of next year. He described Apple's upcoming headset as, quote, the most complicated product Apple has ever designed, and said the product, quote, will further boost the demand for immersive gaming and multimedia entertainment. So more and more signs seem to be pointing to Apple getting ready to release this product that we've been talking about quite a bit. As a matter of fact, this past week in an interview with China Daily, Tim Cook reiterated his excitement about AR technology. He spoke about how he feel how he feels we're just in the quote early in, in early innings of how the technology will evolve. And he pointed to the already 14,000 AR kit apps that are currently in the app store. But then he concluded the interview by saying, stay tuned and you'll see what we have to offer. So the question then becomes, when will we see what they have to offer? And all signs right now are pointing to first half early 2023. So will be exciting times Look forward to seeing that product. It is expected to be a very high price point product. So I don't know how many early adopters will be out there, um, but we're expecting it to be in like the $3,000 range, which is crazy uh, for a headset. So hopefully Apple can blow us away with the demos. Uh, it sounds like it's going to have a lot of great tech in there. And uh, Ming-Chi Kuo saying, hey, it's super complex. And uh, if anybody can pull off a great use case or user experience, I think it's going to be Apple. So I'm looking forward to seeing that product. I'm sure there's going to be a big splashy announcement, uh, but probably not till 2023.